Hey, what's up guys? Hope everyone out there is doing well. My name is Mike and it's time for us to get into another music reaction. I'm super excited for this, by the way. This is uh, new Greta Van Fleet. This is uh, Meeting the Master. This was just released maybe 20 minutes ago. Uh, it says 11 on the screen, but I've been taking a little bit of time to get a drink and read the lyrics uh, for this one. Uh, this is a request. This is going to be for one of my best friends in this world, Ivan, who uh, clued me in that this one was uh, dropping tonight. And... Um, Asked me to check it out. Honestly, he would have had to ask me. I would have anyway. Oh man, I'm super excited for this. So, um, yeah, this is from an upcoming album called Starcatcher. And uh, yeah, this is gonna be, I've been waiting so long for some new Greta to hear, man. So uh, yeah, this is a Vivo video. I'm sorry in advance if it gets blocked for visual content. Um, and if I have to put any kind of editing on the little videos box, but man, I'm excited. I'm so excited, man. I read the lyrics on this and <laughs> I'm not really sure, man. You know, um, to me, just my first instinct from reading these, let me just read part of this. Uh, what a day to meet the master. I've been waiting for so long. Final day to meet the master. It's my time to go home. I'm going to skip forward a bit. Uh, blow it up to give him all of our love. Blow it up to give him all of our love. So, um... It's weird because my first instincts on this makes me think of someone who's been uh, radicalized, you know, or you know, terrorist kind of thing, uh, someone indoctrinated. I could be completely wrong, though, you know, because this is Greta Van Fleet and uh, their message is, you know, peace, love, harmony. So maybe I got that completely wrong. But anyway, um, without further ado, Let's uh, stop blabbing. Let's jump in because I can't wait anymore. Here we go. Greta Van Fleet meeting the master. By the way, you guys hear that rain? I'm sorry if you hear in advance if you hear any thunder or rain because it's storming pretty bad right now. I'm literally staring at uh, the sky lighting up with lightning. Uh, but we're not going to let that stop us, right? Tears of rain, man. Strangely, that's the last song I reacted to by them. Beautiful acoustic, man. I hear some faint strings back there, too. Oh. oh, man, Josh's voice. Wow. Hold on. Let me just do a little bit of commentary on this. Um, wow. This is such a great feeling, man, to hear uh, uh, new Greta. And what a beautiful song this has been so far. Uh, not quite heard them like this with this quality of acoustic in their songs. Um, uh, strangely, Josh's voice seems to have gone through a little bit of a slight evolution too with uh, maybe it's the pronunciation. Whatever it is, it sounds excellent. This uh, latest iteration of GVF, at least this first minute I've heard of it, sounds absolutely awesome. Something sounds a little bit different here, but again, this is something new, so... And you're probably saying, oh, Mike, it's a, it's a new song. That's why it sounds different, man. I get that. But what I'm saying is something else seems a little bit different and new, and I'm all in for it, man. This is great. Let's keep going. I hear a hi-hat. Oh, is that guitar? Like real whimsical sounding thing. It sounds beautiful. It's like he's plucking the strings in a weird way or something. Or strumming in a weird spot. What a day to travel faster. 
Take my trip around the sun I have known no other master Man, this is so beautiful. He has been the only one There's a hat. Stutter on the drums. I'm sorry, let's go back to that little vocal ease he's doing there. That sounds so good, man. boy okay holy crap that was excellent man oh, I I'm partially speechless man that's kind of weird because <laughs> multiple reactions have done that to me tonight but wow Greta Van Fleet meeting the master this was so beautiful and also rocking okay so when the song started I thought this was just gonna be more of an acoustic kind of song um, I don't know, Broken Bells-ish or something. But I was pleasantly surprised when the rest of the band came in. That was great. Got some killer solo action. Uh, Jake was jumping from my right headphone to my left, and then vice versa. Some cool stuff going on there. I moved the mouse earlier um, because I wanted to point out something I heard on the drums, which I said there was like uh, some weird stuff happening on the drums. I think it was somewhere around here. Let's see. <laughs> Yeah, it sounds like, okay, he starts off on this part hitting the hi-hat, and then somehow he somehow switches to the, the ride cymbal without me even really noticing when it started. See? Did you hear that? It like switched from hi-hat to the ride.
Like, how's he doing both at the same time, man? That's weird. Um, but yeah, man, absolutely beautiful instrumentation on this one. That acoustic guitar, I've not quite heard that kind of sound um, from them on any other song. With that kind of mixing and... Uh, it just sounded great, man. That's uh, something else that was new to me on this. Uh, again, I um, I feel like there's... I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just age, maturity. Something is different with this as far as uh, uh, Josh's singing. But uh, I like it. It sounds good, man. It's like he's fallen into his own a little bit more. Um, anytime you hear something new from them, he's kind of fallen more into him himself and his own groove. It's kind of the feeling I'm getting. Um, but yeah, this was a excellent first song. This, uh, <laughs> this song was awesome, man. And uh, man, I can't wait to listen to this like another 10 times to get this really absorbed into my bloodstream. But uh, I'm so glad I got to check this one out tonight. Um, again, on the meaning, I don't know, man. I, I got to be wrong on that, my meaning, because, you know, just for what GVF stands for, the way this one sounds, um, please let me know your thoughts on what you think of the lyrics or if you heard the band uh, say anything about the, the meaning on this one. Um, I feel like once I know exactly what this is about, It'll help me form form a uh, deeper connection emotionally with this one. Uh, but with me, I guess coming from kind of a cynical, you know, I guess I'm cynical if I think that's what the song's about. Um, it's kind of giving me a little bit of a block as far as a, a deeper emotional connection. However, that doesn't stop me from knowing, um, you know, that the song's beautiful. You know what I mean? Um, <laughs> this sounds awesome. This sounds excellent. And... Uh, if this you could consider this like the tone setter for the new album wow this is going to be uh I, and i'm not saying every song is going to be this soft but um it's a great way to set the tone you know what i mean but yeah man i'm eager to hear the rest of this album uh eager to see what else they're going to throw at us but like i said this was a great tone setter uh for this to be the first thing you hear from this upcoming album awesome man Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up, but uh, if you're still here, thanks for taking the time out of your day. Thanks for taking the time to listen to me ramble about this. Uh, I hope you got something out of this video. I hope you enjoyed the new GVF. If you've never heard of GVF, please go check them out. And uh, if you have any other songs you want me to check out, uh, let me know in the comments. Uh, I've pretty much blasted through GVF's uh, catalog as far as reactions go, but um, let me know anyway, or if there's any other band you want me to check out. Thanks, guys. We'll see you on the next one.